This morning, Jerry Falwell Jr.'s time as president of Liberty University may be coming to an end. Falwell telling the Wall Street Journal overnight he submitted his resignation letter. After the university said the embattled evangelist had withdrawn his earlier offer on Monday to step down. Thank you, Becky. I couldn't do it without you. It comes after Falwell gave a lengthy statement to the Washington Examiner saying his wife Becky had an extramarital affair and they were the victims of blackmail. Falwell says his wife had a fatal attraction type situation with an ambitious young man who was working at a Miami hotel. According to Reuters, that man is Giancarlo Granda. Falwell says he was aware of Becky's inappropriate personal relationship, but says he was not involved. Granda told Reuters he had an eight-year sexual relationship with Becky Falwell. He says her husband, Jerry, not only knew about it, but often watched them together. Granda gave Reuters text messages and screenshots he says are from a FaceTime in which Becky was naked, as well as this 2018 audio recording of a conversation with the couple. His new thing is like telling me every time he hooks up with people, like, <laughs> like I don't have feelings or something. You don't make a joke. Yeah. NBC News has not seen the messages or photos shared with Reuters. In 2019, Granda says the relationship grew contentious. Granda writing to Jerry... Since you're okay with ruining my life, I'm going to take the kamikaze route. I wanted to reach a peaceful resolution, but if conflict is what you want, then so be it. Falwell says Granda tried using the affair to extort him, something Granda denies, contending he was trying to end a business relationship with the couple. President Donald J. Trump. The Falwells are some of President Trump's most prominent religious supporters. Last year, Becky spoke with Eric Trump's wife, Laura. We are so proud of our students here at Liberty, and it's it's just such an honor to be able to serve alongside them. We try to teach good family values and good morals. Falwell is currently on a leave of absence from Liberty after posting and then deleting this photo with a woman who is not his wife on Instagram, telling a radio show it was taken at a costume party in good fun. I've apologized to everybody. And I promise my kids I'm going to try to be I'm going to try to be a good boy from here on out. So, so Steph, I mean, besides that statement to the newspaper in Washington, with all of this new information coming to light, has, has anyone actually talked directly to Falwell? Well, Craig, we reached out to Granda and Falwell. Neither responded to our request for comment. But it appears as if the Washington Wall Street Journal, rather, actually had an interview with him. At first, his tone was angry. He was upset that it, that the institution would get rid of him over, in his words, just that Instagram photo. He later acknowledged that he had embarrassed the university and he didn't want to do any further damage to it. 